Hey, uh, welcome to uh, trying to help you to <clears throat> switch uh, to or load up AutoCAD 2020 um, and then uh, being able to change it a little bit so it looks like um, some of the video lessons that we have already um, in a folder on YouTube, on a YouTube channel. Um, so that, uh, you know, they, you'll be able to do some of the exercises. So it's going to load CAD first. So, um, it's probably going to take a couple of yeah, that's confusing. seconds to, to do. So I'll just try and explain that one more time. I'm going to load up AutoCAD 2020 and then I'm going to show you two things, how to change the screen background and, uh, also how to uh, bring up the menu bar again so that 2020 looks uh, like an older version of AutoCAD um, that we have lots of video lessons for um, and then obviously you can go from there and use some of the other features uh, that have been added in the years since the video lessons were done and there are some exercises uh, associated with um, the video lessons. All right, so our screen is coming up. We're, we're getting closer to um, having access here. I'll just uh, check with my mouse. I think I'm possibly still waiting. Yeah, it looks like I am. So um, I'm just going to get started. So, so I'm just going to start a drawing. Um, and this is uh, what the screen will look like. Now, when you load it up, actually, it'll probably uh, look like this. This is the menu bar I was talking about. This is probably what your screen is going to look like when you load up, when you get the free version uh, from CAD, like in the educational version. Um, and uh, the two things I want to show you, one is right here. Um, it's called Show Menu Bar. So you can click it and all of a sudden you will get all of these menus and inside here are all sorts of different commands that you have access to. So, um, and you'll see that uh, when you do um, specific commands, you can always hit escape all the time to get out. Um, when you come here, for instance, to draw uh, and you're going to draw a line, you will see down here that there'll be command line that also shows up. So some of the exercises, the commands are typed in the command line down here. There's lots of options and these are all different commands too. Uh, they're also located up here in the drop down bars. So, so again, when you bring up CAD, this bar along here will not be there. It will again look like this and you're going to show the menu bar. Now, the other thing, too, is in order to complete the exercises, some of the instructions, which are all CAD drawings that you'll load in, um, the background is white, um, and you're going to want the background to be white, too, as opposed to black. So we're going we're to show you how to change this background. So if you go here to Tools, slide down here to Options. Uh, you'll see that there's lots of choices here. You're going to pick the, you know, there's files. You're going to pick the display dialog box. Got all kinds of stuff that you can change. You really don't want to mess with this. You really just want to change the color, which is the background color. See it right here? Uniform background. That's what choice it's on right now. And black is the color. And you're going to just change that to white. And then you're going to apply it and close it. And then you're going to say okay and now the background oh. is white and down here on the bottom are all the different um, assists uh, they'll look a little bit different in 2007 for instance if you don't want the grid you can just turn off the grid if you like the grid or if the grid is used in the exercises then you can turn the grid back on um, and all the other um, associated uh, assists down at the bottom here are the same again the icons might look a little bit different, but if you hover over them, they'll, they'll say what they are. Um, okay, that's the first thing I wanted to talk about. And then also, uh, I wanted to show you where um, the videos 
are going to be. So I'm just going to minimize this and I'm going to open Chrome and I'm going to open YouTube. And I'm going to go and search for LLC 201 teacher and uh, enter or search and you'll see this comes up and I double click it and uh, there's a bunch of playlists so I'm going to go to all the playlists and um, you'll see there's all kinds of different softwares here and you're going to slide down to generally be in this the AutoCAD Lite 2007 view full playlist is what you want to do um, and if you want, you can go and look at view uh, full playlist for AutoCAD 2011 um, uh, also. Uh, that might be helpful uh, with some changes that took place uh, four years after 2007 was done. So that's up to you. I'm going to put this uh, video lesson in uh, the 2007 AutoCAD Lite playlist. So again, make sure you hit view for a playlist. And then these are all of the concepts that you can go through. These are all the videos that are associated with all the things required to be able to execute some drawings. Um, I would suggest that you watch uh, 16 first because it talks about setting up appropriately. So it's a great place to start. Um, and then slide to the top and start with uh, number one. Okay, I hope that that makes sense.